You know, I wanted to uh, just say a few things, and one of them is that we've had some really good information come here this evening. And that information came from the young people who spoke. Yes. These are the people who we are talking about. It is their lives and the lives of their friends and their schoolmates that we're talking about, but are we listening to what they're saying? In my other life, other than being a state senator, I have a foundation. I'm not going to advertise it, but we give scholarships to students to go to college. The majority of those students come from the Jersey City public school system. As part of the process, as part of the process for getting a scholarship, I sit down with these young people and talk to them about one, what is your school life been like to this point? Two, why do you want to go to college? Three, what is it that you want to do when you go to college? Four, my goal is that you come back to Jersey City and Bayonne and be involved in the community. Is that your goal? Mm, right. It is interesting to me to hear young people talk about good experiences. It's interesting to me to hear young people who are articulate and who are able to talk about the programs they were in while they were in the Jersey City school system. I am not going to stand here and say that the Jersey City public school system is the best school in the state. It is the best system in the state. That's debatable. But one of the other things that I do in Trenton is I sit on the joint bipartisan education committee. That's right. And what that means is that we have meetings all over the state and we talk about education. And when it comes to public education in urban areas, I was very proud to hear that of all the Abbott districts, out of all the other districts, Jersey City was the best. All right. Now, this does not mean, this does not mean that it is perfect. This does not mean that we have the students who are all going to Harvard. There were failing schools everywhere. Yes, this. New York. Someone told me that uh, someone was looking at someone from New York to come in. Well, uh, Bloomberg just had 40 schools that were failing. This is something that is happening, and I'm not saying that we should overlook it. But what I'm saying is, let's lay the blame where the blame belongs. It is not just Dr. X. If, and I said this the last time I spoke, if the decision to do a search was this board's decision, that's one thing. If it, this is mandated by politics, that's another thing. There are 247,000 plus people in the city of Jersey City. If those people came here and said, I want to search, then you take the $300,000 and you have a search. If not, I don't want to hear about it. Do the, the majority people who are here now, do you want to have a search? No. 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 young people that I am paying for to go to college all around this country. Those are the people that we need to be 